X Max, I'm trying to build a beast. I eight S beast this time. So I'm I purchased the eleven hundred KV Hobby Wing Easy Run fifty six eighty seven motor. Plus I got the Vita Bone twenty thirty five T mod one point five. These are mod one point five. All right. Okay, and I got the motor mount that will fit this motor. So you cannot fit a third party motor other than Traxxas in the stock, in the stock motor mount system. Already got max five in here. So the truck I have is with max five. The only upgrade I did to the truck is the ESC plus this. A spur gear holder because it was breaking a lot the plastic one it was rubbing up the bearings inside so this is a solution without the kosher drive system or anything in between so it will eliminate that and we have mod 1.5 gears so Vitavon I think did very well stuff this part over here will sit on the shaft and it will sit at the end of this place so the shaft will be holded from both places, forth and back. So I'll fit them up. Then we will take this beast for a run and I hope it will compete with the Kraton. I also purchased a new set of batteries. These are the Z-Bar 100C 9000 mah. Some people said they will run for 40 minutes and they fit perfect in the battery tray stock battery tray in the x max yep they are just sitting so nice over here and why not if it will run forever that's much better all right guys as you can see here i took the rear end of the x max apart from the x max itself i cleaned the whole parts a lot and i just removed the old motor because I'll install the new spur gear and I'll show that in a moment along with the new motor stupid cushion drive system so Vitavon all the way for the X Max when it's sitting over here the stock one it's not supported by this part over here at the end can you see there the shaft is just loose and it's can it can go up or down like that the shaft and all, 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 all of this stuff I'm taking out and put them on the new shaft. So I took out the cushion drive, out the spur gear, three screws, and I installed the bearings which I have because I have the fast eddy bearings. I don't want to lose them, they are still perfect shape and form. So this is the Vita Bone shaft. So here is the Vita Bone part assembled completely. One bearing in here one bearing at the end and one pin only the other pin you keep it in your old shaft you don't need that and, and it will fit perfectly in the place without any movement like in the old system look at this look at this boy look how smooth is that ticking like a clock really amazing design finally someone did it yep okay guys then you put the cover here long screws this side short screws this side as i said from aliexpress i bought this motor mount and i'm going to fit it right over here i just need to remove the pins which come from factory because they are useless now I'm going to open up my new motor look at this beast oh my god and oops, I installed the inner part outside. So I need to flip the motor mount again. OMG. Here we are learning from my mistakes. Just this part should be outside, not in. Right, like that. Well, what I found out, you can only set your 1100 KV 5687 with this motor mount with two screws only cannot put a four screws in it so guys with this motor mount it's a must for getting the metal parts like this downstairs why because you need to adjust the mesh manually 
I got the perfect mesh for me where I like it to be I checked everywhere perfect and if you are wondering about getting back your cover like that it will not fit because you have bigger Vita Vaughn gears now either way you keep it like that or you need to buy a separate Vita Vaughn cover which is for me expensive <laughs> I just skip that and run it as it is like that open so when you put it back together you need to just cut this part out you see it and here I put it all together the new motor is hobby wing right now Vita 1 is sitting up in there you can see mod 1.5 finally okay guys let's fire it up and see Here we are, moment of truth, yep, so we will take it out and test it, alright guys that's it for this video, for the next video because this part is going so long subscribe in the next part by the weekend i will take it out and i will take a proper video and test the whole system in you and show you the results like and see you in the next one